Okay, this is for set 2A and 2B. Warm up is beast pose, cobra rock back, T spine, floor press, cool downs, thread the needle, butterfly stretch, and the world's greatest stretch. I'll go through the warm up stretches first, there will be a pause, and then I'll do the cool down stretches. Warm-ups for sessions 2A and 2B, beast pose, cobra rock back, and a T-spine spine floor press. Five reps of each, twice through. So, beast pose, you're going to be on all fours. You're probably going to be doing this inside. Today's the only day that's actually sunny. Hands shoulder width apart, under your shoulders, feet back, knees underneath your hips. All you're going to do is lift your body off the ground and you're going to slowly rock back and forward, just feeling a bit of tension from your body. So one rep is back and forward, two reps back and forward, three reps back and forward, four reps back and forward, and then five, last two, finishing under the shoulders. Next rep is a cobra rock back. Now we're going to keep your knees planted on the ground. So you're going to go hands out a little bit further, all the way back, stretching through the back, and then all the way forward into a cobra position. You want to go from full spinal extension with your back arched into a flat back position with your back rounded, head down, arms stretched. So forward and back is one rep, go through five repeats, and that'll be your five. The last rep in this one is a T-spine floor press. Take your hands, push them together, our hands straight. What you're going to do is you're going to push your hands into the ground. As you push your hands into the ground, your elbows are going to push out, kind of like a vice. Keep pressure on your elbows, keep pressure through your back, keep your back flat. What you should find is that as you push down, it's very similar to this stretch here, standing up, but now you've got the pressure on the floor, it's going to open up your, your, your thoracic spine around your ribs. You might hear a click or two, that's actually a quite a good thing. And that's the cool down, uh, warm up, beg your pardon. For the cool down, after you've gone through your exercise, if you're on your bike, row or run, We've got thread the needle, we have done this before, one hand on the ground, either one hand on your head to use your elbow to thread, comes through the hole, to the knee, and then opens back up, so we start to get your lumbar spine down the bottom. You can do this with your hand, bring your hand in, through the hole, and open back up. Do five on the left side, five on the right side, Butterfly stretch, this is sat down, feet together, and all you're doing is pushing your knees out, holding it for five seconds. Last stretch, world well, greatest stretch, in a lunge position, knee under your hip and shoulder, front foot under the front knee, your hand goes down, open up to the right hand side. And then open up to the left hand side. Five with the left leg leading, five with the right leg leading. That's your warm up stretches and cool down stretches. Five of each, twice through. That's for 2A and 2B.